El Campo senior running back Ruben Owens has finally committed. Ruben, you can't escape the color red or the birds, can you? Nah, I love red, so. <laughs> so why the red though? Uh, I just caught a vibe with the coaches, you know. I like the facilities. Um, and when I was out there, it was, I had a real nice time. So, yeah. Now, you were telling me you played uh, seven on seven with a few of the players there. So tell me how that influenced you and how that was like. Uh, so at seven on seven, when I went up there, like I've been messaging them online and stuff before I went up there. So when I went up there, I just clicked with them. You know, we got we got a real tight bond and stuff. And then the, me and Pierce, we had a great connection, chemistry on the field. So yeah. Now you recently went to Louisville for a visit. Uh, tell me what that was like. The visit was nice, you know, they took us out to places, we went to the Churchill Downs, we went to a horse race and stuff, and then they took some of the recruit down, like, to see the horses uh, run, like, right by the thing, so we, like, face-to-face -face actually, so that was nice. Speaking of Churchill, uh, I saw that Jack Harlow gave you a shout-out on Instagram. Yeah. Uh, you got to walk me through that. How did that work out? Well, to be honest, I didn't even know, like, he was going to do that. He just, I get, he a big Louisville fan, I guess, so. When he seen our committee, he just reposted it, and I was like, dang, that was crazy. Ruben, what does it mean to these other schools now that you've committed to Louisville? I ain't, I ain't talking to other schools. Uh, tell me what your teammates think about your decision. Uh, my Campbell teammates? Yes. They, um, they gave me, they told me congratulations. They were, everyone was just shocked, you know. <laughs> they was like, you got every school in the nation. Why, <laughs> why you chose Louisville? So, so, yeah. Ruben, I think the entire world was in shock after you announced that. But so tell me about your teammates in Louisville and, and how that's gonna be like. Oh, so we got we got Piers, you know, he's a top ranked quarterback in our class, and then we got DeAndre Moore. He also he's a top ranked receiver. Then we got Jaleel, he's a top ranked receiver too. Then we got Jamari, uh, he a top ranked tight end. So we got like the number one class right now, twenty three, and then I'm trying to add a few more pieces. Oh you're trying to add a few yeah. more pieces. Okay. Coach Ruben, tell me uh, the the chemistry you and the quarterback do have. You said you guys are really are really close. So uh, walk me through that. Describe that relationship. So first day we was out there, we was like talking. Like we didn't play no games, so we were just chilling. Like we clicked. Like we had a, we was just talking about things. He was like, he, you know, he was trying to recruit me to get to Louisville and things like that. He was telling us like it's gonna be nice when you go out there. So the second day we played, and then like we clicked. Like he was just, you know, he was throwing me the back shoulders and. I was having nice catches, like he was giving me the ball, getting me involved early, so I just knew from there it was going to be like, yeah. With all these top picks, what can the people expect from Louisville when, you're, when you get there? Uh, Heisman Trophy candidate. That would be nice. Yeah. I would definitely vote. <laughs> Ruben, tell me, uh, there were talks about wherever you go, Arch Manning will go, wherever Arch Manning goes, you will go. The people were talking about that. Uh, where do you think Arch is going to be going now? Oh, well, I can't, I don't know where he's going. We was cool, um, we and Arch were real cool, you know, he told me congratulations on my commitment. So, well, whatever he decides, I'll be, I'll be proud of him. I want to ask you about, um, you said you're going to focus on your season now. You guys made it pretty far last year with El Campo. What are you hoping to get your senior year here? I'm hoping to get a state championship, you know. Uh, we got a few young guys on our team, you know, most, are, most of my line graduated. So we just, we working right now build them up, get them ready for the season. What did Chad World say about your commitment? He was excited for me, you know. He been helping me throughout this process, so he was excited that when I committed. Ruben, I want to know, I think the people want to know, are you going to be wearing number four when you get to Louisville? I should be, yeah. Yeah, I am. We got to keep the four so crazy. Yeah, right? got, got to, got to, got to. And just to remind people, what? how did the four so crazy start? Uh, so I was like, actually, I'm, I'm gonna give y'all the honest truth. So someone on Instagram, uh, his name Aaron, he's from um, in the car. He went to in the car. His name was for so crazy. But he went to Alabama. I mean, his senior. So his, his Instagram handle was for so crazy. Lit, yeah, look, look. Okay. His his Instagram handle was for so crazy. His um junior year at in the car, and then his senior he switched to two. So he changed his name to like Deuce, you know, Deuce is like two. So I took four so crazy. And then he, he DM'd me about it. He was like, you like that name, huh? I was like, yeah. So yeah, now he's at Alabama. Okay, so is this someone you looked up to? Nah, <laughs> I just liked his name. He cool though, he, he real good receiver. I feel like he gonna make an impact at Alabama. 
All right, can we see your Louisville? You already got a lanyard of Louisville. What else oh, do yeah. you have of Louisville here for us? Uh, this is just it right now. I got a few bracelets, you know. I got, yeah, I just got this lanyard, Louisville. I got my key on it. Hey, Ruben, well, we're, I'm gonna look out for you this year, your senior year, and hopefully you guys do go pretty far before you head to Louisville. Congratulations mm -hmm. on your commitment, and I cannot wait to see what you're gonna do in college, and hopefully one day I'll be talking to you in the NFL. Okay. So, congratulations, Ruben. Yeah.